last night, but I'm glad you won first prize. <laughs> Hello, YouTube and YouTube viewers. It is Cody Williams again, and I'm going to show you guys how to do a Triceratops dinosaur. We all kind of know the T-Rex, and we've shown the Brachiosaurus, and I haven't seen many videos on a Triceratops, so this is the one that I use in restaurants, and hopefully you guys enjoy it. It's going to take three 260s and some rounds for the eyes. Uh, we can do it in... This one's the most the color they want. They usually pick green or gray, are the most common colors they pick for dinosaurs. Uh, I'm not sure what color they really were, and I don't even know what color to make the feathers. So let's just go with gray. We're going to blow this balloon up to about five fingers of a tail, maybe six. And tie it up. So, what we're going to do is, this is going to be the first horn. So let's make this about three fingers. There we go. And we're going to do an ear twist here for his bottom lip of his mouth. And we're going to do a bird body for a face. This is kind of face made for a lot of animals. So one, do an ear twist here. So you got like a four finger bubble, an ear twist. Make a four finger bubble, come back and connect back to the first ear twist. And before we connect it, we might as well do the eyes now. This way you don't have to shove them in or anything. It's a little bit easier for you. So, oops. We're going to make a white and brown, oh, sorry, white and black. Find the size you want the eyes to be and make the black half of that size. Tie these together. From here, split the white, split the black, put them together, and now you have good old fashioned googly eyes. So, we're going to lie this down facing forward. We're going to tautly pull the gray back and connect it with that back ear twist. Like so. From here, we're going to do a two finger bubble, ear twist, one inch bubble, ear twist, a one inch bubble, ear twist, and we're going to do a two finger bubble, and we're going to connect that back to the beginning. Now, I have a little bit too much air in mine because I want to come back up to here. So we're going to break the very tip. I'm going to edit it down to the size that I want. If you add a little less air, it might fit a little easier. I'm going to connect that back. Like so. And you want to have this look. There's a lot of different routes to take to get this but that's the way I usually take. You could also come down, up, and back over. Just all, all different ways. So now we're gonna need another grade 60 for the horns and another one for the body. So blow this one up. This one we're gonna break so much of this off. Whoop. Make a little pinch twist. Make the horn kind of whoop up and twist it. Connect this to the side of your twist of the head. And I like to make this bubble a little longer than it is already, kind of widen this out a bit, and connect it to the back of his head. Now do the same thing over here, like so. We're going to edit down so they're the same size. I don't need this anymore. And tie it off. There we go. Here is his face. Now we're going to make the body. Blow this one up to about four or five fingers of a tail. Connect it back at that neck joint. It's really strong. There we go. We're going to do a two-finger roll for the neck. An ear twist, and the rest of this is just uh, the body we, a lot of us do. It's dog legs and a bird body and dog legs. Do a four finger bubble, another four finger bubble back to the ear twist, a four finger bubble, an ear twist, a four finger back to the first ear twist, a four finger back to the second ear twist, four finger, followed by another four finger, and the rest of this can just be his tail. You can edit this to any size you want it to be. But it's just a really fast body. This is a sign I use a lot from usually restaurants and 
just my cookie parties. This is a, you want to make a detail, but you don't want to spend a lot of time. So, this makes us the Triceratops dinosaur. So, this design is kind of fun, pretty fast. And hope you guys enjoy. Have a great day today, a better tomorrow. We'll let you guys have fun. I'll see you next time on YouTube.